In this problem, we're asked to find the inverse of this function if it exists. Well, how do we know if the inverse of a function exists? The inverse of this function exists if it is a one-to-one -one function. And the simplest way to figure out if it's one-to-one -one is to sketch its graph. So remember, this function is in the form of y equals mx plus b. So it's going to be a straight line. And in this case, what is m? m is negative 2 or negative 2 over 1. And what is the y-intercept? It is 0, 5. So if I was to do a very, very rough sketch, here's my y-intercept. And my slope is negative 2 over 1, so I'm going to go down 2 over 1. So my graph is going to be a slanted straight line like that. I, I don't need an accurate graph, just a rough sketch, because now you're going to do the horizontal line test on it. And if I graph a horizontal line, how many times is it going to cross my function? One time. So this function passes the horizontal line test. It's therefore one-to-one, -one and the inverse exists. So now we know the inverse exists. All we have to do is go find the inverse. So remember the steps for finding the inverse. Step one is you replace f of x with y. So we're going to write our function as y equals negative 2x plus 5. Step two is interchange x and y. Wherever you see a y, put an x. Wherever you see an x, put a y. So I get x equals negative 2y plus 5. And then what we have to do is solve for y. So that means in this equation, I have to get y by itself. So let me rewrite my equation that I'm trying to solve for y. And the first thing I better do is subtract 5 from both sides. So I get x minus 5 equals negative 2y. And the last thing I have to do is divide both sides by negative 2. And on the left-hand side, you might find it easier if you divide each of them by negative 2. So we're going to get y equals negative 1 half x, and I could have written that as negative x over 2, plus 5 halves. Because remember, a negative divided by a negative is a positive. And the last thing I have to do is how do I write the inverse of my function f? Remember, it's f with a negative 1 exponent of x equals negative 1 half x plus 5 halves.